Hey guys, it's Liz here. I've gotten a lot of questions about how I printed out these um, photo strips. So today I'm gonna walk you through those steps really quickly. So here we are in Photoshop. I've pulled all the images I want to print onto this document. The file size is eight and a half and 11 because that's the size of my photo paper. Configuring the images was simple. All of the files were already square because that's how I had them set up in Illustrator. Let me just show you that. Here's my artboard in Illustrator. And these are all set up as six by six squares. So back to Photoshop. Um, so basically importing these photos, all I had to do was just pull them from Illustrator and resize and size them down to fit. And the squares here are 1.3 inches wide. Before printing, I like to add a hairline thin stroke around the images so that I can get precise cuts for the images with the white or washed out backgrounds. It's something that I do so often, I just save this as a style so I can easily apply it when I need to. Okay, and now I'm ready to send this file to print. Here's a printed file, and to get those photo booth-like strips, you just cut them down lengthwise. This is where applying that print border is really helpful. Make sure that I can get the perfect cut. And that's it. I hope you found it helpful. I will be making this available as a template in my shop so you can easily make your own photo strips. And for those of you that are new to Photoshop, I will also be doing a video tutorial to walk you through the process of how to use Photoshop templates. And I'll be covering the basics like how to insert your photos, how to resize, and all of that good stuff. So be on the lookout for that soon.